Yo, what's up guys? I wanna share with you how you can record your screen using Microsoft PowerPoint. Maybe right now a lot of educators are looking for a way to record their presentation on their computer screen with explanations before they give it to their students, well, as well as content creators. I know that most of us use PowerPoint to present presentations to students explaining things. It will be just a quick procedure that I'm going to show you so that you can start recording your screen using Microsoft PowerPoint with your presentation being recorded and your explanations. So let's get started right now. So here in my computer, let's start by opening PowerPoint. Okay, so I'm using PowerPoint 2016. This also works on older versions of Microsoft PowerPoint. So here I'll just go ahead and kind of select a sample PowerPoint presentation that I have here. I'll just go ahead and select this one, create. This is a template with Microsoft, so it's already made. Uh, so you can see my presentation right now. This is the kind of the edit mode of uh, PowerPoint. You go ahead to insert. Now here on the insert, you can see here on the right upper corner screen recording. You go ahead and click this one. Then you will have these options here. You can select the area here, the whole area like this. I'll uh, click the select area and then I can select my whole screen or you can select a portion of your screen. Well, I'll just go ahead and do it like this. And uh, now you can also set up your audio so that if you want to record your explanation, then you go ahead. And you have also an option of recording your pointer. So if you don't want to record your pointer, you go ahead and remove the selection. So I'll just select both because I want the audio to be recorded as well. And then if you want to record this one, just click on the button uh, record. So I'll just go ahead and click record. Then it will count to three. Now, if you want to stop this recording, you just go hover up here and then this will uh, pop up. You can pause or you can stop. Now, if you're going to pause, the recording will stop, but uh, you can still continue it later on. But if you want to stop, this will cut your recording and then show you the record that you have already done. Now, for now, let's just go ahead and try a sample presentation. Okay, so basically this is already recording. Um, everything you're doing on your screen is being recorded. So if you wanna try and uh, um, help somebody out in operating this computer, uh, how to navigate going to the settings, this will already be recording right now. Now, how about if we go to our presentation? So of course we need to open our PowerPoint and then uh, we get to present this PowerPoint like that. So if you want to explain this one, um, yeah, you, you get to like uh, um, go for for this and that. You want to explain these gears. You want to explain the element one, element two, element three. You go for next. Your audio is being recorded right now. And yeah, how about if you want to um, um, give some explanation here, just get a pen and let's try to see, draw something here like this one, that one. So your content is being recorded if you're trying to draw things on your screen, you can go for next and try to see the next slide. So let's just go ahead and end up here. I'll just escape this one so that we can um, uh, proceed, discard. Then I'm just going to go um, minimize this one and then this will show up. I'll go ahead and stop. Then there you go. Uh, this is the video that is recorded. Put this one into a new file, file, new and then blank so that I'll, I'll just get that um, file so I'll just copy this one copy and put it on the blank presentation I'll just put it here so that we can see that I'll just go ahead and use the full screen so that we are going to export this one as a video like a full scale okay so this is already a video uh, this is inside PowerPoint. So what if we want this video to be a video not in PowerPoint? So I'll just go ahead and go here file and then export and then I'll go create a video You can select the quality here a 1920 by 1080p then um, I'll just go ahead and create video So I'll save this one uh, presentation uh, presentation video Okay and then I'll just save it on uh, my documents so that we can go ahead and check that one later. So you can see the progress down here where it is being uh, uh, saved as a video. So you need to wait for that to complete. I'll show you when this is already done. All right. 
so the video is done we can go ahead and check this one on our documents where we save the file so I'll just minimize this and uh, go to my documents locate that presentation so it should be here okay this one presentation video I'll just go ahead and open this okay so this is the video that we had then as you can see I'm playing this one on a uh, VLC so let's try to skip um, this is the recording we did with the settings page and um, we try to skip again here on our uh, presentation then yeah we recorded that skip yep this is the uh, gears page and then the content page the drawing scenario that we had with that uh, presentation we skip again skip yeah we got it all uh, so i hope you have learned something from this video guys let me know in the comments below what you think about this screen recorder that comes with powerpoint and uh, help me make a dream of 100,000 subscribers like this video hit subscribe if you are not yet subscribed share this to your friends once again this is me Troy pro and i thank you for watching goodbye See you on my next video.